Here's an example of that photo bleaching that I mentioned in this gallery. You can see that uh, in the bottom row is just PBS with glycerol, and this dye, which is a uh, fluorescein or FITSI, phylloidin, photo bleaches away and becomes dim very quickly. Whereas if you use prolonged gold, or even better, prolonged diamond, you see that you retain your signal over that entire minute. Now, a minute doesn't sound like a lot of time, but actually it's quite long for imaging, and you need time in order to orient your cells and, and find what you need without the dye just disappearing. So choosing an antifade is important. But what else can you do? Well, you want to reduce the light intensity and the duration that it's on the sample, because the more light there is, the, the stronger the light, the longer the light, the more photo bleaching you have. So you want to be quick about imaging, about setting it up. If you use a traditional microscope, you might even throw in a neutral density filter while you find cells of interest. Now, if, if, the cell, if your dye is just so sensitive that photo bleaches away really quickly, even in an antifade, then you might want to consider having a second dye, like DAPI, for instance, that you can use to find your cells and set it up, and then you quickly switch over and take the image in the dye that's not as stable. Remember, your hardware settings play a role, too. Exposure time. The longer your exposure time, the more photo bleaching you'll get. For those who like data, here are some graphs that show photo bleaching. Uh, these are normalized to their initial intensity, and you can see over time that the uh, intensity decreases um, or goes down as you see the lines here. Yellow is just PBS, and for many samples that's the worst. But using an antifade mounting medium like our prolonged diamond in green here, you can see that you're able to retain the signal much better over time. We have a selection guide online that you can use to help choose an antifade mountant. You can see the URL here. Remember, using an antifade mountant means you have a more stable signal and a longer lasting signal to give you the best signal to background.